first thought that comes to your mind when we talk about the social media following for each coach. So let's go with Team Stilo. Team Stilo. What is he wearing today? <laughs> or Perfect the Cat. I get a lot of that. And Perfect the Cat, the cat by the way, has 30,000 followers on Twitter. Yeah. Let's talk about Team Blake. Um, the first thing I think of. Yeah. <laughs> There's so many funny things to say <laughs> other than drinks and the bar. Um, <laughs> um, nurturing, very sweet, tall and handsome. I've seen his drunk tweets. I think they're hilarious. <laughs> I don't know if he's actually drunk all the time or if he's just, like, being really funny, but he's a really funny guy, and he's actually not that drunk, and it's just, like, the ongoing joke with all of us, but he's such a sweetheart. Really nice guy. Yeah, great. Uh, let's go Team Adam. Oh, well, first thing I think of when I think Team Adam, like, girls swooning. Like, every time I put up a picture, they're just, like, fainting. It's just, that's what it seems like, especially on their um, on my Twitter uh Mentions and then um, I just think he's really talented, beautiful eyes, tall. He's actually tall, and uh, great voice. Yes. Great. Not to be broken record, but mm -hmm. tell me a little bit more about Team Christina's followers. Um, Team Christina's followers want to know everything about her from when's her next album coming out, her next single. They know the title of her next album. And, but then when I think about her also, and since I've been working with her, I see how much she actually cares about her artists and how and how into it she really is she's really like this is a not only is it a job for when you see them on tv you know in those moments on mondays and on tuesdays like they're working throughout the week at the rehearsals and really giving these people advice so that when the live shows happen they they can bring it so when you listen to her she knows what she's talking about so yeah talented diva <laughs> yes.